Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Tuesday, coming at you with 2021 Panini Contenders Football. Three box, pick your team number six. And if you follow the instructions here, you got a chance at some break credit. But we'll do that randomizer at the end. Big thanks to, and from a fresh case as well, big thanks to everyone here for making it happen. Appreciate it. On Tuesday the 17th, Kevin Smith ended up with that double last spot in Mojo. That's why he has those stars next to his name. Bought the last two teams at once. There is 2021 Contenders Football. There it is, fresh case. So we have four stacks of three here. We're gonna select a die. We'll select that one. One, two, three. Sorry, check that. One, two, three, four. Right? Five or six, we'll just roll again. Four, one, two, three, four. So these we will save for next time. And I may just grab three random boxes next time, or I may unveil a dice roll scenario. So, either way, it'll it'll be some some semblance of randomness right there. So there's all the X's there. So the next three boxes are up. So get after it, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We can run it back tonight. And if, you, if you're one of the lucky winners of that break credit, I mean, that's $500, top, top two, get $500 of break credit each. Um, that's, a, that's a football mixer spot. So maybe if you're feeling if you're feeling like it, I think it'd be appreciated by us and the rest of the crew if, if you put that towards a mixer spot. That'd be awesome. Every so often we'll talk about break credit strategy. I think a lot of times people will buy like a, will get like, you know, thousand dollars of break credit or something like that. And then they kind of, I've seen this happen over the years where, where some people will We'll start spending it on like a $20 spot here, or $20 spot there, and try to stretch that break credit out. But I think that's almost like a, a death by a thousand cuts kind of situation because usually those are like, you're buying like $40, $50 fillers or something like that. And if you're not getting, if you're not lucky enough to get the, the spots on top, then you know, you're just kind of burning through your break credit. What I would do is I would, you know, obviously you can strategize however you want to, but if if I got like a thousand dollars of break credit, I would put it towards a team that I would that I would never um, that I would never buy. Like a lot of people are like, oh man, I would never. I don't have the money to buy the the Charlotte Hornets straight up or something like that. You know, but with the break credit, maybe you you would buy the spot, buy the team that you normally wouldn't buy. So a lot of people are sitting here going, I probably. I wouldn't buy a $600 mixer spot, but if you had some break credit helping out. There's Chaz Surratt, rookie ticket autograph, Vikings. No, not like that, like a, like a team that's like one of the higher end teams, Mike. Like one of the, one of the top end teams. All right, so Chaz Surratt for the Vikings goes to Joshua. The redemption is Josh Allen, veteran playoff ticket autograph. I'm assuming that's got to be... That's got to be quarterback Josh Allen, right? Not defensive end Josh Allen? Let's go to the checklist. 
2021. Let's search contenders. Not draft, but regular hobby edition. Regular edition. Groupbreakchecklist.com. Group break team checklist. Josh Allen, card number one. It's quarterback Josh Allen. Auto veteran ticket plus parallels. Card number one, Bills, Josh Allen. So there you go. Joshua with Josh Allen. I guess he also had the Jaguars too. So, so it would have either version of Josh Allen would have uh, gone to him. But this is specifically quarterback edition of Josh Allen. Buffalo! And more. Buffalo! Playoff ticket autograph. 79 out of 99, Greg Rousseau. You know, the great defensive end or linebacker, if you will. But a solid part of that Bills defense. And we've got rookie ticket autograph on card, Kenneth Gainwell. Showed some bright moments last year with the Eagles. That's going to go to Joshua and the Eagles. We've got 2-2 Atwell, Rookie of the Year contenders, 7 out of 99. That'll be for Oliver and the Rams. Oh, also, we'll do a left-right randomizers on, on those. Sometimes those can be numbered. We will do the numbered ones separately. Here's another Eagle, Rookie Ticket Autograph, Jacoby Stevens. Kobe Stevens. Philadelphia Eagles, Joshua. All right, there are your five autographs there. Next, second box, good luck. Any, oh, this is a sad story. I was looking at, looking up some football note, news and notes while I opened these packs. Poor Tariq Cohen, running back Tariq Cohen, appears to suffer leg injury after missing most of the 2020 NFL season with a torn ACL and MCL, as well as a tibial plateau fracture, and missing the entire 2021 season, recovering from those injuries. Former Bears running back Tariq Cohen may be looking at another unfortunate setback. And according to Jonathan Jones of CBS Sports, Cohen looks to have suffered a serious lower leg injury during a workout that he was streaming on Instagram Live. That sucks. I've not seen the video yet, but here he is trying to come back, trying to show people that he's that he's healthy, and then Um, NFL draft pick signings. I guess Bears locked down Velas Jones, third round wide receiver. Got him under the rookie deal. Sam Williams, Jalen Tolbert, second round, third rounder for the Cowboys, also locked in. Third rounder, third round pick for the Lions, Kirby Jones, Joseph, locked in. Colts uh, signed their second round wide receiver, Alec Pierce, as well. And we got a nice, uh, speaking of the Bears, Daz Newsom, rookie ticket. Ticket stub die cut autograph. <laughs> yeah, I saw that, Rex. Yeah, 
Uh, it's going to be interesting to see how that case unfolds. There's William Bradley King. And is that a Jaguar flipped around there? It looks like a quarterback, right? Is that an auto? Here's rookie ticket autograph William Bradley King for the Commanders, Corey with Washington. Or is that is this is this just Panini trolling me? Is this just like an insert that they flipped around? It's an autograph, rookie ticket on card auto T Law. Trevor Lawrence Joshua with the Jacksonville Jaguars with the Trevor Lawrence. Nice. Looks pretty nice too. Maybe if you're nitpicking and the, the graders will nitpick, there is a little bit of white on it on that corner there, but I'm not sure how they do centering on, on cards like this. But from, from here, you can see the blue borders seem to be pretty even. Could grade out nicely. And this, I mean, he essentially, a lost season for him his rookie year, just with all the coaching drama there. But I wonder if this year could be a nice breakout season for him. Here's two out of 25, Kyler Murray winning ticket. Yeah, what if they actually got, got Jennifer Lawrence's autograph? That's for the Cardinals. Mark with the Cardinals. And we've got a playoff ticket. Sage Surratt. 20, uh, 27, 57 out of 99. Playoffs? Playoffs? Serenity with Detroit. New Kids in the Hall released on Prime. I have no interest in that. There's plenty of old kids in the hall. Rookie ticket autograph, Elijah Molden. Uh, Titans, Joshua with the Titans. All right, final box coming up. percent of reboots are just not very good. I think I did see some trailers for it and I just didn't was not impressed. Well, original Kids in the Hall that's, that's, that's comedy classic. Like a lot of people want a lot of people want to see a bit of Fry and Laurie with Stephen Fry and Hugh Laurie, the classic uh, British comedy show, which I'm sure everyone in this chat is familiar with. Um, people ask them to reboot that, and they're like, eh, why reboot that? Those original, those originals episodes back in the day are great. Third and final box. We got Eddie George, 58 out of 99. Power players for the Titans. He was, a, was indeed a power player. Joshua with the Titans with that insert. And we've got a Jet. Hamsa Nasir Ildin. Nasir Ildin. I think I got that. Corey with the Jets. Say 
And we got a Ben Skoronek. Rookie ticket autograph, die cut, that little ticket stub design for the Rams. I think he, he had some key catches in the playoffs last year. That's for Oliver and the Rams. Rex's favorite British show was uh, Are You Being Served? I think I've seen some episodes of that. Yeah, how many how many good U.S. sitcoms or reboots of old British sitcoms? Rookie ticket autograph, Larry Roundtree. The Office. UK Office is better, of course. Everyone knows that. The Office. I think uh, Coupling was the show that inspired Friends. There's Larry Roundtree right there for the Chargers. That'll go to Oliver. And there was another show in the UK that ultimately uh, inspired Veep. And there's Jennifer King, coach's ticket autograph. I didn't realize there were coaches in here. 25 out of 49, that's pretty cool. Corey with the Commanders. In fact, I think a lot of the, the UK version of Veep, different title, uh, I think some of the some of the original writers or directors or staff ended up writing for writing on Veep. Veep, which is a delightful show, not family friendly at all, but very delightful. All right, and the last hit is going to be a redemption. Did we? Oh, there it is. One, two, three, four autographs. Here's our fifth. I was like, I thought we got shorted an autograph. All right. It's like a poker card here. It's going to be Pat Fryermuth, rookie ticket stub, RPS. Steelers, last spot mojo, Kevin Smith. There you go, Kevin. Got one at the very end. And that's for the Pittsburgh Steelers. All right. Thanks, everybody. Now, we got to do a couple randomizers. We got to give away some break credit, and we got to see who's going to get those uh, round numbers cards. So let's flip back to random.org. Let's first blank list is going to be left side, right side. And the break credit, if you follow the instructions, you got to buy at least two teams. So let's alphabetize your names by first name. Corey bought two teams, that's an entry. Jason bought two teams, that's an entry. Joshua bought a bunch of teams. Joshua bought 16 teams, half the teams. That's eight entries. Kevin Smith bought two teams, that's an entry. Mark bought four teams, that's two entries. Oliver bought two teams, that's an entry. Patrick bought two teams, that's an entry. And Serenity bought two teams, that's an entry. I think everyone bought an even number of teams because it's full 16 spots. Thank you. Let's just spot check really quick. I got Corey, Jason, Joshua, Kevin, Mark, Oliver, Patrick, Serenity. All right. And top two, $500 break credit each. All right, let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Two and a six, both lists eight times. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight times, left side will get them. So left side teams will get those round number cards. Once again, two and a six, eight times for the names here. Top two, $500, $500 of break credit each. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven and eighth and final time. Fingers crossed. Good luck. Top two, Joshua. He had the odds on his side. It worked out. This I've seen it not work out um, with that many odds, but this time it did, Joshua. There you go. So I'll send you one break credit code for a thousand dollars. There you have it. I'm Joe for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us, and I will see you next time for the next break. Bye bye.